Hi everyone, this is Laura Hammock from the Marble Jar channel. And in today's video, I will show you how I present, prevented myself from getting duplicates on Google Photos. So I'm a big Google Photos fan, and I have been urging folks to offload photos from their iPhones onto Google Photos so that they can save space and as a long-term photo storage solution. A little while ago, I started getting duplicates on Google Photos. So I have an iPhone, and this video is going to be specific to iOS issues. My duplicates look like this. So I would go through my phone, and arbitrarily delete one of those duplicates. The problem was I would go back later and I was losing some of these. Instead of just deleting one of them, Google Photos would have neither of them. Well, this was clearly an unacceptable situation. After some trial and error, what I realized is that for nearly all of my duplicates, I would have one that would look like this and one that had a tiny cloud icon at the bottom. So I determined that the icon meant that that photo had not been uploaded to the cloud meaning that photo was only on this specific device. So if I looked at Google Photos from another source, say from my computer, I wouldn't see any of those duplicated photos, only the ones that had been synced and uploaded. The reason I was losing photos is that I was arbitrarily deleting one of the duplicates, and sometimes that was the one that had already been uploaded to Google Photos. So for a while, my fix was to go in and only delete the photos that had this little cloud icon on them. Well, this started to become an enormous pain in the butt. I would delete photos on my iPhone only to have, the to, to have to delete the very same photos on my iPad. Last month, both of my kids went to a school dance, which produced a ton of photos, and I spent multiple sessions determining which ones to keep, only to have to do it all over again on another device. What was going on? So the first thing I tried was going into settings, scrolling down to camera, and turning off keep normal photo. So I had read that this is a reasonably new um, setting that has been implemented that keeps two copies of a photo on your phone. Unfortunately, this did not seem to take care of the issue entirely. What worked for me was turning off PhotoStream, which I had stupidly still had turned on. So PhotoStream is an iOS feature that allows for you to share photos across devices. I tend to take pictures on my iPhone, the camera's better, but I view them on my iPad, the screen is bigger. So PhotoStream allows you to do that automatically and pretty much immediately. The thing is, Google Photos allows you to do that as well. It just takes a little longer for the photos to upload to the cloud and then be available on a separate device. So I turned off PhotoStream by going into settings, then photos, and then toggled this off by PhotoStream. Okay, so the sharing between devices is not quite as seamless through photo, as, as through PhotoStream. I either have to wait a little bit for the photo to show up um, on Google Photos, or I can force it to happening, happen by going into the Google Photos app on my phone and manually triggering a backup. But I no longer have to worry about duplicates, which means saved time and not losing photos. Let me know what you think. Comments are always appreciated, and thanks for watching.